A different exercise my family and I like to do are alternating step ups. You can use dumbbells if you have, you can use cans of food, you can use water bottles, or you can use your backpack for extra weight. Also, make sure that you have a steady stool or you can use your stairs. What's important for alternating step ups is to ensure that when you take your one step up, you have your full foot on the stool and I want you to use your glute to explode up and hold. Then you're gonna come down and you're gonna alternate feet and hold. If you don't have dumbbells, you can do the same thing, but with added weight and just alternate. You can be more explosive or you can be a little bit relaxed. Another exercise that I do with my family are push-ups. If you want to make it more challenging, we change the tempo. Three down, two hold, one up. This is what it looks like. One, two, three, one, two, up. One, two, three, one, two, up. If you find that's too challenging, you can go on your knees and just do a regular tempo push-up. There you go. One of the exercises that I do with my family are reverse lunges. We do about eight to 12 reps, depending on the weight that you can use. Right now, I'm using a 40 pound dumbbell on each side. If you don't have that, you can use a backpack, which I'll demonstrate. Or, Put some books in there. And that's your reverse lunge. An exercise that my family and I like to do are side planks. To make it more challenging, I'll show you a leg extension that you can do. Make sure that your shoulder and your arm are in line. Extend your hips up and hold. If you want it more challenging, try lifting your leg and holding or you can even pulse your leg. Another alternative that you can do is stay here, reach under, and extend. Try doing that on the opposite side as well. One of my favorite core exercises is called dead bug. You can use different types of equipment to help you, or you can use none at all. I'll show you what this looks like. You're gonna push the ball into the center of your body your right arm and your left leg are going to extend out while I push into the ball and my leg. Then I'm going to squeeze in and then alternate. If you don't have a ball, you can use a pillow and do the same thing. If you don't have that, use nothing at all. And that's your dead bug.